Hello everybody, welcome back, and I am the Chornik, and today, ladies and gentlemen, we are going to talk about the Pokemon 2020 calendar, what people think is going on, why is there a Sylveon on the Pokemon 2020 calendar, why is this significant, why do we need to take notice to this, okay? So a lot of people believe that this is giving some sort of hint towards Serena, whether she's coming back, you know, because it's Pokemon 2020, why would they show Sylveon on there? There's no other anime companion of Ashes that has a Sylveon unless Lana evolves her Eevee into one, right? And then we have Shaman and Alolan Vulpix also featured on this calendar. Well, to me, I'm not thinking too much of this. I'm not going to be like, oh my gosh, this is big news. But only if they start marketing this like crazy. Only if they start marketing Sylveon like crazy, does to me, does that seem very, very suspicious. But a lot of people are thinking, okay, why they're having Sylveon on this, you know, calendar for 2020. You know, past Pokemon calendars, you know, usually have to do with the anime. So, like, there's been calendars where Ash and his companions were on. There were calendars where... Pikachu and other Ash's Pokemon were on and but most of the time at the beginning of every region they would just have Pikachu and like the three starters right and back in Sun and Moon they just had Pikachu and the three starters and that was like the calendar for that year but now that they're going into the next anime the next generation you would expect it would just be Pikachu and the three starters I mean we don't know any of the other Pokemon that Ash's companions would have if he's even in the anime, because we, as we know, that it might not even feature Ash. It has Pikachu on it, though, which makes us think, okay, well, then Ash will be in the next anime. Probably, maybe. Okay, or it's just because Pikachu's on it because Pikachu's the mascot of Pokemon. So that's very possible, too. However, we also see three other Pokemon, which is the thing that I think we all need to take note of, and those three in particular. Okay, we have Sylveon, which we could relate to Serena, right? Then we have Shaman and Alolan Vulpix, which we could relate Shaman to Mallow and relate the Vulpix to Lily, right? So why is like this significant? Well, why those three? Why those three in particular? Why are they all Pokemon of Ash's companions? If this means that Serena is going to return, then I would be really happy to see that this could also mean that Mallow would return because I'm a huge Mallow fan, right? I love Mallow, and if Shaman, if this means that Serena is returning with Sylveon, dude, we could have Ash, Serena, Mallow, and Lily all traveling together. That would be like the best group ever. Not gonna lie, that would be awesome because I would just love seeing Mallow back. So I'm more hyped for this <laughs> being hints that Mallow is gonna return rather than Serena. Of course, I love Serena and all that, but I just think that her ending was so good that I'm afraid to see what they're gonna do, you know, if, she, if she's brought back. I'd rather just see some flash forward of them being married or something in the future with a kid or, you know, the next anime being Ash when he's way older. Like, I'd rather have that. I'd rather not have seeing them unite again and all that. I, I don't want to see that for some reason. I just, I, I just feel like that's gonna ruin it. I'm really skeptical and really nervous about seeing Serena coming back because I just, I'm worried about what they're gonna do with it. But if Mallow's coming back, fantastic. I'm even more excited for that. But why is this so noticeable too, though, is that why are they choosing these three Pokemon on the calendar? And a lot of people might think that, hey, you know what? Maybe this could be that the next anime is showcasing all the regions. So maybe that's why they're showcasing these three extra Pokemon on there because, you know, like this next anime is going to be featuring all the regions and we could be going to all the different regions and seeing these kinds of Pokemon. That's why they're being featured. So that's a very, very big possibility as well. However, why would they choose these three? And that's kind of what we go back to. Why these three? Why Shaman? Sylveon kind of makes sense because it's a recent evolution of Eevee and Eevee's been marketed like crazy. So Sylveon kind of honestly makes sense why they would market it. But why Shaman? Why Alolan Vulpix? Why those two? I mean, yes, they're cute and they're somewhat well known, right? But why? So, to be honest, all three of them, again, are Ash's companion's Pokemon, so it kind of begs the question, like, does this mean that they're going to be shown in the next anime? Are we going to see Mallow and Lily in the next anime on their own story? Are they going to be with Ash? Like, what's going to happen, right? And Serena, are we going to see, like, her own journey? Like, maybe she's going to some, so some sort of spinoff, like, over in Johto or Hoenn or whatever, right? Or is she going to be actually present with Ash in this anime? I don't, I'm not thinking too much of it right now. It's just a calendar, but it's just interesting that they're marketing it this way. 
why they chose three, three Pokemon, why on this calendar? Why not just show Pikachu and the starters like you do for all the other regions when they first release, right? So why why this one? Why you know like why is it different? Honestly, if we see more marketing material that showcases these three, then I would say that's a huge flag. That's like that's something to take notice of because if they start marketing it like crazy, you know something's up. So we'll keep on our eyes out. But anyways, ladies and gentlemen, please post in the comments section below your thoughts and feelings about this. Are you hyped? Do you want Serena to come back? Do you not want her to come back? I know I want Mallow to come back. You better want Mallow to come back. Because if you don't, I don't know what's, what's wrong with you. You know what I mean? But <laughs> Mallow is just the love of my life. But anyway, ladies and gentlemen, please post in the comments section below. Subscribe if you have not yet. We're going to try to find more information about this stuff. And we have the actual trailer some more information details coming out confirmed to be the september the 29th right so we'll see more information then i love you guys can't wait to see you in the next one and peace off thank you very much